You know the fact you lecture me on honesty and acceptance is hilarious, right? What are you trying to say? You finally been honest with your parents and told them you gay? Well, listen, have they not met me? How can I be anything else? Seriously, I'm not responsible for their blindness? But nice try, though, bro. We ain't done talking about Man, you. you always just talking in. Well, she's a rapper and actress, and you know her from the hit CW series All American as Coop, who plays a gay teen. Coop is a gay teen who goes through drama with her parents and close circle of friends. She's here to fill us in on what we can expect in season two, though. Welcome. Welcome. Yeah. Thank you. We were on the Pride float with you yesterday. Did Floating. you have so much fun? Yeah, I had a ball. Was it your was first nice. Pride? It wasn't my first pride, it was my first time being on the float. On the float. Yeah, I've never floated awesome. like that. Awesome. So pitch. many people were coming up to you, too. Yeah, yeah they were it was so nice. excited to meet you. They were. What do you usually do for the month of June, then? Uh, I usually, I'm usually, like, just chilling, taking it easy. I mean, because July, you know, early July, mid-July is when we go back into filming. So it's kind of like, I just okay. relax. I don't the try to do too much. She's a working right. woman. Uh, right. <laughs> yeah. And I've known you forever. Now, yeah. How did you even get the, the nickname Breezy? My grandmother gave me that name. Really? Uh, yeah. Granny got born. swag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did Granny spell it for you, or did you do that? Um, actually, my grandmother, to be honest, like she spelled it like a few different ways over the years. So yeah. you know, it's so whatever she writes. I mean, but that's what she came up with. Yeah. Awesome. So, yeah. So you actually lived in Chicago. That's kind of like your second home, as you claim it. You were filming Empire here. Yeah, yeah. That was one of your first acting roles, right? Yeah, it was the first. Oh, yeah, wow. that was the absolute first. Yeah, and that that brought me um, straight to Chicago. I had never been here before. I didn't know anybody. I had no idea you guys freeze people in the wintertime. <laughs> <laughs> it was just Man. like wow, wow, you know. But it was nice. Like I love the city. The people were embracing, you know, tone. Yeah, I know. Yeah, of course, yeah. You've been yeah, it was great. Cool. And the cool thing about it is, I don't think a lot of people know that you were actually like well, barber before you even started, yeah, started yeah. acting, right? Yeah. So, How did that happen? Um, I mean, a lot of, I, my father cuts hair, my grandfather, kind of something that just ran in my family. Um, mm -hmm. But the people that knew me in my real life, or normal life, you know, they were like, dang, are you doing this on TV too? Like, <laughs> yeah. People were like, oh no, she really do that. And I'm like, yeah, I do, but you know. I yeah. think it's your authenticity, like, yeah. that has yeah. gotten you so far. Like, you're so real and so true to yourself. How, what was the transition from barber to now I'm a celebrity? I'm a rapper, <laughs> I'm an actress. Like, what was that transition like? Because I think a lot of people will have dreams and aspirations like that. Um, I think for me, um, the barbering industry definitely put me in front of a lot of people who were already, oh, quote, nice. unquote, celebrities yeah. or, you know, whatever. You know, so for me, it wasn't like, oh, God, I'm just this and I'm that. And it's like, I've always been that. Mm -hmm. I've always been that. You just didn't know me. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Right. So it's like, I feel like everybody is, you know, popular or whatever in their own little, uh, you know, world. Right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Sure. So for me, it just was like, it wasn't nothing that was brand new to me. I think the only thing that came as a, a, a surprise, you know, was a business. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, really just handling business correctly. And yeah. now everyone obviously is loving your show, All American. Yeah. What can you tell us about season two? Um, I mean, season one was a lot. Season one was a lot. It was a, it was a crazy cliffhanger at the end. Um, you know, just who's the father and, you know, is Coop gonna, you know, just really embed herself in this gang life. And, you know, hopefully season two, you know, we, we really, Coop figures it out. Hopefully yeah. we get, a, you know, some understanding of, you know, what is life going to be like for her because it's kind of just been a battle after a battle after yeah. a battle. You know, as far as my character is concerned, but um, nice. no spoilers no here. Spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> I was working with Tay Diggs before we go. We're like, tell us more, tell us more. Tay Diggs is a, is a, is a, a comedian. Like, he's just really? kind of like, what? Yeah, he's, he's so not natural. serious at yeah. all. So it's just like... You can't even, you cannot stand <laughs> in front of him and not laugh at Look him. Look at Carly. Like, that's so that's funny now. Cool. Carly's yeah. sitting, yeah. yeah. sitting on the edge of our seat. sitting on the edge yeah, of our seat. Yeah, but we had a prior like, relationship. Like, I mean, we did okay, Empire yeah. together, too. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, to yeah. be back, you know, working with him is just that's like, cool. it just makes it fun. You awesome. Know, well, you're going to stick easier. around. You're going to stick around with I'm us. Sticking. We're going to play a game for yeah. you in a little bit. All okay. Right. Be, <laughs> be sure, sure to keep, keep up, up with Breezy on social media for all American updates. Chicago's new home for the CW, CW26 debuts September 1st. And season two of All American, it premieres Monday, October 7th, right here on CW26.